What's up guys, welcome back to Daily Driven Exotics. My name is Damon Fryer and today is a special video. It's not me hooning the Huracan or anything crazy like that or driving dealership car. No, look, it's the holiday season. Um, it's a season for giving and receiving. I love to give back to people and not just during December, but all throughout the year. When I have the opportunity to come across someone who loves these cars, I take the time if I can to share it with them. I had a very special case of this. I had this cute little letter that says important, open please, little hearts, like exclamation mark, um, dropped off on my door, a handwritten letter that I got given by a young lady, 11 years old, her name's Brielle. And Brielle happens to live in my neighborhood and she wrote this handwritten letter, two, two, double-sided, drew a little cute picture of my car. And I got home one night and uh, found this letter on my door and opened it up and very heartwarming story. This young girl, her father sees my car when I drive by in my neighborhood all the time. And he's just like, I guess like, oh, look, it's a Lamborghini and he gets excited. And she, you know, picks up on this and she wants to make her dad happy. You know, like we all want to make the people we love in our lives happy. And so she wrote this letter, came to my house and basically states that, you know, she would be asking me to fulfill her Christmas gift of giving to her dad his first Lamborghini experience. And I was just like, I mean, it's, it's, it's emotional. It's really, it's really cute. You know, I have three daughters. And so they only live a couple of blocks away. I got in touch with Brielle and her mom. And today's the day we're gonna take the Huracan. We're gonna take the letter. I don't even think he knows about the letter. So I'm gonna bring the letter and share it with him that this is what his daughter has done and um, gonna go pick him up and take him for his first ride in the Huracan. So I've already warmed the car up. Why don't we just dive into the car and head over to their house and see his reaction. His name's Jeff, by the way. I've gotten a little bit of information aside from this because I've been texting with the mom over the last 24 hours. So I'm super excited. Let's go see what Jeff has to say. This is the house, I'm pretty sure. This is it. Let's go surprise him with the car. <laughs> Let's see what Jeff thinks. <laughs> you must be Jeff. What's up, man? My name is Damon. Cool. Hey, Damon. Did my daughter hey. put you up to this? She did, actually. You know what? It's super cute. She uh, she wrote me a letter. No way. Yeah. She Bree. delivered it to my house. You little munch. Here. Is this her? Yeah. Hey, how's it going, sweetie? Hi. My name's Damon. Hi. Nice to meet you. Yeah, you too. Super sweet of you to do that. Thanks. I have three daughters, you know. Oh, really? Yeah. I have a little one, and then I got two teenagers. Oh. So you're kind of in the middle of all of my <laughs> girls. So she wrote this really sweet letter about how you love the channel and how you love supercars. And uh, I thought, you know, I'm sorry I couldn't get back to you right away. That's all fine. you left was an address and I thought, <laughs> I'll ruin the surprise if I just come by. Yeah. So I'm glad you came back to the house and I was in Vancouver if you've been watching the videos. I've been I'm gone. Watching one right now. Yeah. <laughs> no lie. So yeah, oh, well, I'd awesome. love to keep this if that's cool. And um, this is so cool. Yeah, so I thought, why don't we bring the car by and uh, throw you in the car? You can sit in the front seat, check out the driver's side, <laughs> and then I'm going to take you for a ride in it. Get out. Yeah, yeah. Jump in there. Take a bunch of pictures. Oh, you have no idea. You know that my wife and I have been to Lamborghini in Italy. Oh, really? Yeah. I have. haven't even been there. <laughs> I need to go. And I've never sat in one. I've, this has been my dream car for... Forever. Hi, how's it going? Hi, Damon. Good. Hi, I'm Heather. Nice to meet you, Heather. Nice Who's this? You. This is Griffin. Is Griffin friendly? <laughs> oh, yeah. <he's> okay. <laughs> he wasn't sure oh what to think goodness. of the sound of the car that pulled up. <laughs> oh, yeah. Dogs, uh, I might freak him out a little. It's like firecrackers when it goes off, which yeah, they don't like awesome. either. Well, Damon, this is so cool. Hey, can Bree sit in the other side? Yeah, yeah. Go oh, ahead, Bree. Jump in. I won't start it. No, no, no. It's fine. It's so cool. You want me to help you with the How door? Does it open? Here, I'll, I'll help you. I can make it so they pop out. There you go. What? <laughs> oh, 
Sorry, it's got the normal doors. I couldn't opt for the expensive Lamborghini that has the crazy doors. Right? Yeah, that's why I scrape it on everything. The front end is low, really low. You just, it's just a fob, so if you just hold on to that, you got the key. And then, um, yeah, so uh, you probably know what to do. Flip foot the, the uh, yeah, foot on the brake, flip that up, and just hit it. Yeah. yeah. And so if we stick it, if you take this and push it down one into sport, it'll make the most noise. So just pull down, yeah. Oh, There you go. Sweet. Yeah, go nuts. You can go right up to 85. Yeah, the whole neighborhood. Full, full on limiter, right? So you oh, you can go all the way up. Just slam it. It'll go right up to a limiter. Yeah. Unbelievable. Yeah. Unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. It's fun, isn't it? So here, before you get out, so on this button right here, push and hold that in, and you'll see how it toggles through, and you can oh, go like, it. things like, huge. you can go like a huge nav. Oh, get it. So it's got all the cool. Yeah, yeah. Um, how do you toggle that? Just navigation. Or, yeah, or, yeah. Or the wheel? Yeah. So, oh, you yeah can, so you can like, Oh, yeah. I see, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and then it'll, you can zoom in and zoom out, and that's all done through this. Um, yeah, you can go like satellite radio. This thing has all sorts of stuff. So sick. And then if you push that down one more time, it goes to that like Aventador mode I always talk about. Oh yeah. You this wanna go for a ride? No. Are you kidding? Let's yes. go. No, this is we'll leave it running. Killer. Backpacking. We were, we were in Bologna and we were, it's like, when are you gonna go to Italy again? So my wife knew how much of a Lamborghini fan I was. So we took the train back to Modena and on one side of Modena is Maranello, the other yeah. side is Sant'Agata. Yeah. And we took a little, literally a city bus, and it's like going out to Machos and it's in the sticks. And no one speaks a word of English. They drop us off, literally at the front gates of Lamborghini, and on the other side is a farmer's field. This was in like 96. And we go into the security kiosk in the, in the uh, parking lot, and the guy there doesn't speak any English. So the guy comes in the back door and he's, he's like, hey, can I help you in perfect English? And I explain who we are and he's like, you're from Van Victoria? Is that near Vancouver? I said, yeah. He goes, are you a Canucks fan? I'm like, yeah. He goes, I'm from New York. I'm a Rangers fan. He goes, well, you know, my, we don't give tours. We don't have a museum. But if you come back in about an hour, I've got my day started and I'll give you guys a quick tour. Turns out he was the assistant to the president. So we had to meet the president. He took us through an hour and a half tour of every corner of the planet. Wow. They, they were making Diablos at the time. It was, it was like a dream come true. This, That's so cool. And so, this, this is the culmination of that. Seriously. This hey, is my pleasure. What's funny, I live right around the corner. So this thing is uh, supercharged. Oh yeah. VF Engineering Vorsteiner, does a, yeah. an amazing job with their superchargers. Yeah, Vorsteiner body kit. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. VF Engineering right. supercharger exhaust tune. Yeah. Um, Vorsteiner wheel or uh, wheels on here. Right. And Actually, then, the body kit is killer. It's really it's cool. a great looking kit. I cannot believe the grip. It's not bad for snow tires. want to do this if this was new to you but I've owned this car and daily drive it in the rain so, so when you down or upshift yeah it blips oh upshift awesome yeah and the best thing to do is this car if you have it in sport if you're rolling it'll rev but it won't um here I'll show you so if you drive and you give it some throttle under load and let off it'll do the pops yeah if I just go into neutral and we're moving yeah. and rev it, there'll be no pops. The only way to get pops if you want to rev it is to be still. Okay. I think dumb. a lot of people don't okay, know this that. This is going to be a dumb question. So watch this. So watch. Now that we're not moving, pops. But what is it? What, what makes it? Yeah. yeah. That's a good question. Like I've always I honestly wondered, don't like know. What is it that's doing I think that? it's just like it's just a it's just something they make the car do for. Like an, it's like an experience. Ask Nick. Because I don't, I don't Nick think it. VF I don't think it's needed. Like, right. And that this, and this, great, yeah, the stock sport exhaust from Lamborghini does it too. Really? Yeah. So like, the, they designed the car to do that. Oh, but I don't know if it's like a needed. Thing, yeah. I don't know if it's a needed function because previous to the Huracan, 
no cars did that. And now it seems like all the cars do that. Like a, a new Porsche Turbo S will do that. Do the pops in the back, yeah, yeah. backfiring thing. Oh, they've obviously tuned it or programmed yeah. it to do that, yeah. That's a good but question. But that's, that's wild though, how when you rev it in neutral and you're going, it's just like a smooth. Yeah, it won't do it at all. Like, watch. Note up and so down. it's in neutral right now. No pops. So I don't know what makes it. And then you can just, you can put oh, it yeah, back yeah. in gear. Oh, that sounds and, great, even when you're. Yeah. So, so it's breaking loose there a little bit because traction control is kicking in. But if I turn just traction control off. So it's limited off, probably with valves or something like that. Or like something. here's, if you turn traction control off, it'll just do a huge burnout. That was second to third, just fully Jeez. spinning. <laughs> Seriously. Uh, Damon, you have no idea. Oh, my pleasure. Oh, really, you have no idea. Like, I, I was putting up the Christmas lights the other day and I could hear you coming and it's just, every time I'm just smiling, going, that's <laughs> so cool. Gobsmack how stuck you are to the road. I mean, it's pouring rain. Oh, yeah. And you didn't budge going up the hill. No, and the brakes like, are, <laughs> the brakes are mega too. If you, like, if we go down this hill and just, hammer the brakes for a sec. So if you're like... So like, watch the brakes. <laughs> Straight as an arrow. Yeah. Un ABS was kicking in, because like you said, it's really wet out. Unreal. But uh, the combination of the tires so and the, the ABS and... The Honda, min the Honda minivan doesn't kind of... No. Doesn't quite equal that. <laughs> yeah. Well, I can't thank you enough. Hey, I'm serious. Let's take some more photos. Oh, that was so cool. Let's take a picture. I think he likes it. <laughs> yeah, you think? <laughs> Maybe just a little bit. You can come sit in this side. <laughs> Bree, if you want, you can come play on the driver's side. Oh, no. Woo. Grab the paddles. It's like playing with a video game oh. scene. Nice. <laughs> what do you think? We have a Honda van, so there's really no comparison. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> You should see what some of the Honda vans in California look like. I've seen them with wheels, airbags. People do them right up. How do you get over the curb without destroying them? So on these little toggle like buttons up there, yeah. the second button over at the very, very top up oh. there, oh, okay. that's a lift system. So the front end goes oh, up, cool. goes up about that high. Just really? enough to help me get in and out of stuff. Yeah. yeah. Oops. The gas yeah. right over on this side. It's actually really simple. You know, back in the day, Lamborghini and Ferrari were really, really known for making like a solid billet aluminum gas cap. Oh, and now, yeah. they, now they don't have it. Oh, now it's just, <laughs> it's got this little thing. You just push it up and it goes in. No, no gas cap. Oh, these, rims. Oh, these are the stock, these are the stock, yeah. stock wheels. Uh, well, again, I can't thank you enough. I'm serious. Both of you clowns. Yeah. <laughs> Can we get a picture of the three of us? Yeah. Uh, there. <laughs> nice to meet you. Yes, you too. Hey, nice to meet you, Jeff. Oh, thanks so much, dude. And nice Seriously. to meet you. Nice to meet you too. And uh, you're in my neighborhood. Anytime, hey! anytime you guys see me, like, come say hi. Okay. When we have a sunny day, we'll put on the summer tires over at the racetrack, mm -hmm. so we can drive to the racetrack and do donuts. <laughs> oh, yeah. Take your dad for some donuts in the Lambo. <laughs> yeah. Okay, guys. Merry Christmas. Okay. Thanks, have guys. a good day. Bye. <laughs> my pleasure. What a great family. Well, guys, I hope you liked today's video. I always love sharing the car with people, but now I got to go and get on with the rest of my day. Smash that subscribe button, throw me a thumbs up on this video, and I'll see y'all tomorrow.